right? You're just, um, you're sly. That's what it is. You're sly about it. Okay. Okay. All right. Are we proud of you? Are we proud of you? Today, we have kind of a special group because um, we wanted to invite teenagers who either have lived in Vietnam or were born in Vietnam or have parents who were. If you are not comfortable answering a question or talking about something, that's fine. You know, it's up to you what you want to share, okay? Do you feel like you get treated differently, like just when you're out, you know, in the community? Like, do you feel like you'll be treated differently than other people? Most other people in my school, they don't think I'm Asian. Right, same thing. They, they say I don't look like it. I just, I don't speak like it. I don't act like it. I don't know. I just don't get it. <laughs> How do you feel when you when? It's just you weird. I'm, 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 I'm just looking at them like, okay. Like, okay. Like, I'm the same way. It's like, when I first meet me, they think that I'm fresh, that the first impression of me is think I'm Mexican. Because, like, the tone of my skin, like, my eyes are not... Asian and like the way I talk and stuff like that. I was just like, their first impression is think I'm not Asian, stuff like that. Mm. Uh, some people think that we look like Chinese when we <laughs> Just our face and stuff. Do people say that? Yes, a lot. Mm. And they, they, they say that we know Kung Fu, karate. <laughs> so they kind of make assumptions. Yes. Yeah. Or don't you like the assumption when like, they know that only Asians do nails. <laughs> like since, like, you're Asian, you know how to do nails and all that stuff. Mm. Like, cause when you no. walk in, it's all like Vietnamese people doing nails well. and stuff. Sometimes, Vietnamese people feel uncomfortable about them about themselves when they go to school and stuff because the eyes and like other kids will make fun of them because they're Vietnamese. And sometimes some Vietnamese people or other Asians will regret being that or hate being that because of other what other people say. Mm, okay. That's some. I mean, like most people feel that way. I can tell. Okay. But, like, what schools do you all go to? I go to Cleveland, Cleveland and JROTC. I go Gateway Middle. I'm in Gateway High School. Um, McKinley High. And I go to St. Francis Cabrini. Okay. So let's talk about, yeah, what, what are some experiences you have in the schools? Like, how do you feel about your school? Well, my high school, Gateway High School, is really, it's actually pretty fun. Like, when I went there the first week, I didn't like it. But when you get more into it, it get the, more, the activity get more fun. The clubs that you go in, it gets more exciting, and the homework get harder. <laughs> yeah. yeah, my dad, he's he's always on me about doing my homework. So is my mom. Like he really wants me to get like into a good college and graduate from high school. And it's just like, I mean, I'm trying to do my best, but like, I'm don't think I'm trying really hard, but I'm getting there. I. I personally don't get straight A's, and um, but I, I feel kind of bad about like letting my parents down, and um, but I try my best. I got like I don't know, probably uh, 3.9, a 3.8, some, but uh, yeah, I think they're still proud of me for um, having for doing good at school. Does everyone's parents speak um, English? Does anyone have to help their folks out? I sometimes do. Like, when we go to doctors, I have to, like, if they don't hire a translator or an interpreter, I usually just help them translate. My dad, he speaks a little English, but he writes a lot of, like, writes a lot of English, so he can just write it, and then he can just give it to his um, manager or something. But when I go to the doctors or a school or somewhere else, I just have to help him, or my sister helps him, like, tell him, like, what they're saying, and then... He just tells us what tells us what to say, and then we just tell so, the person that um, what he says. So it's a bit hard sometimes because mm -hmm. I don't know that much Vietnamese. Mm -hmm. Is there anything we didn't talk about? Just like the drop chest. I don't know. I don't know what to say. Uh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Grandma. Hi, Grandma. <laughs> talk to Vietnamese. You don't speak English. <laughs> 
I think I know what Jaime. Okay. <laughs> <laughs>